we are back at the house. Sorry I couldn't show you us catching them, but there wasn't that much to see. Just taking scoops and getting them. Um, they're really hard to see, too, so when we got great footage. But, yeah, let's take a All look right, at them. Alright, here they are. They're not very active right now. There's a snail on the wall. I don't know how he got there. But, um, yeah, they're Colombian spotted frogs. About a month and a half, if I had to guess. So, pretty big. That one actually right there in the middle. If you might just saw that, uh, he had his limb bud out. He's got a big leg for so how So, this is about the time where they're metamorphing. So, if we get some more tadpoles and, like, they've got more arms and legs, we will make a video on that. And, so, let's talk about them for a they second. They are Colombian spotted frogs. Colombian spotted frogs, full grown, get about eight inches long. They actually live their entire life in the water, but they only breathe water as tadpoles or froglets. Um, but as they get older, they just sit in the water and wait and look for food, I guess. Um, they eat stuff like worms, crickets, roaches. Don't have a lot of roaches here, but they'll eat it. They'll basically eat anything that moves in front of their mouth, which is how most amphibians are. And you got to be very careful when you're handling them because like all amphibians, they get, they breathe through their skin. So if you've got like some chemicals or soap on your skin, it will sink through to them and possibly kill them. So we don't want that to happen. But um, they are very cool. These guys, I'm guessing, um, are two months, month and a half old. I'm not very, I'm not that sure because when they hatch, they hatch totally different. Like, one could hatch one day, and then the next could ha hatch two weeks later. So it's hard to tell. Um, there was, I was actually surprised there was no mother frog protecting them around. Usually when they're a little frog, when they're tiny tadpoles like that, they usually have a mama frog protecting them. These guys did not. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, hit that like button. If you didn't, don't. I don't care, but, um, if you subscribe if you want to see more of this. Um, this summer we're going to be taking a trip to Idaho, and we're going to catch some big polywogs. Polywogs are basically these guys, but a bit older, and they're, but they are way bigger, like, maybe five inches long. We're going to be looking for bullfrogs there and stuff, so, you want to stay tuned to that, so, thanks for watching.